Okay, wrapping your hands. So, really important to know how to wrap your hands. Why is it important to wrap our hands? Number one is for wrist protection. Number two, to protect the knuckles and also the small bones in the hand. Usually depends on the length of your hand wrap, but these are your standard size. Uh, you can find them at your local sports store. So, again, they usually come wrapped up like this. I want you to open them up and unravel them. Try to make sure that there's not too many uh, creases or uh, tangles when you unwrap it. Now it's going to come with this loop at the end and generally the normal way to wrap the hands I'm going to put the loop around the thumb. I don't want you to do it that way. Okay? What I want you to do, I want you to take the wraps and I want you to wrap it around your four fingers and knuckles four times. Once you have that, it's going to give you a kind of layer of padding. Okay? With this layer of padding, we're going to take this end and we're going to pinch it between our thumb and index finger right over the knuckles. Once we have that, we're going to wrap it from underneath and then over two times as necessary. From there, from underneath the hand, we're going to go over the thumb. Again, make sure that there are no folds or any creases. Once we've gone over the thumb, we're going to go over the wrist. We're going to go over the wrist many times. So right now, two times is sufficient. Now from the bottom of my hand, on the thumb side, I'm going to go over towards in between the pinky and the ring finger. I'm going to keep my hand open, but once I've reached here, I'm going to close my hand and make a fist. Again, go over the wrist. Once it comes from underneath, again, on the thumb side, we're going to go on the opposite side between the index finger and the middle finger. Open the hand and then make a fist. Again, wrap around the wrist. Once we're coming underneath, once more time, we're going to go towards the middle between the middle finger and the ring finger. Open the hand, close the wrist, and around the wrist. Okay. So now, instead of coming over the wrist, we're going to go over the knuckles once, twice. Once we have that, we have this nice layer of protection over top, now we're going to go over the back of the hand. See, there's a little bit of uh, skin showing. I want to cover that area. All right, nice and firm. Now we're going to cover the thumb one more time. We should have enough wrap left. And finally, we're going to reinforce the wrists. Once, twice, three times. So once you've wrapped, it should be nice and firm. It shouldn't be too tight that it's taking away circulation from your hand. Okay. When you feel it, you should feel pretty tough, like you should be able to punch through uh, wooden boards or through some bricks, okay? So that's the way to wrap your hands. Other side, I'll show you. Both hands nice and firm. Again, we got that protection over the knuckles with that padding. Also, we have the wrist protection and also protecting of the metacarpals. So now you're ready to do your kickboxing.